warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And here we have Crystal Palace against Manchester City. Well, I'm Peter Drury and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Begley. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. I'm ready to see what unfolds in this one now. And he has been fouled there. He has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. Not had too much on it. Ruben Diaz, Grealish, Laporte, looking up to see who wants it, passes it through, he's had a go! Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. Well, when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in, such are the margins of success and failure in this game, that was so close. Oh, that's so close to a dream start, and it could have made such a difference for what's to follow. I mean, this looks as if it could be quite an exciting game. Sacco tries to get it forward quickly. Mateta. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Ayu. Kelly. To heart. It's a promising run he's making on the right. <laughs> Mamadou Sacco. First quarter of an hour gone. Crystal Palace yet to have a shot on target. Balls loose, who's getting there? Laporte demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Stones. João Cancelo pumps it forwards. It's well blocked and back out it comes. Gundogan gets it back. Isi. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne. Bernardo Silva. Foden. And it's Grealish. Matt, whistle's gone, that's a foul. Oh, what a save! He had a long way to go. Well, what a tester for the goalkeeper because it was struck with real venom and I thought he dealt with it really well. MacArthur with a long pass. Cut out in the nick of time. Here it is now, surely! Ruben Diaz, Gundogan, Foden, and that is going to be the final action of the first half, how's the first half compared with your expectation? Well this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers, nothing has been created for them, I think the service has been extremely poor. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half-time. A tight old game so far. Can that change now? Dan. 
Kelly. To Hart. Just making a foray down the right. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Kelly. Looks like a good ball through. Zaha. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Ayu. Gundogan hurtles into the tackle. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. It's a long forward pass. Stupid defending to ensure they got no further. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Now the pass. And it's Mateta. Looks to slip it through. That's offside. Yes, it is. Oh, it looked like a training ground drill that almost worked a treat, only for that flag to go up. He just went a tad early. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Gundogan. Spoon forward. De Bruyne. Just about up to 75 minutes. It was a report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection of what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. Manchester City, their final change. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Mares gets it back. Has gone out. The Bruin battles to win it back. Mendy with the ball through. Fernandinho. To heart into the last five minutes. Kelly hurtling down that right flank. Forward it goes. Mateta Benteke tries a through ball Zaha that's a throw Benteke and that's that and stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches.